Hey y'all, it's Elijah from Elijah's Beauty, and today is day one of Vlogmas, even though it's not really day one, but y'all know, I just felt like it was stupid, you know, December started on, was it a Thursday this year, and I just felt like it was stupid to start my Vlogmas, my like weekly Vlogmas, in the middle of the week, that just felt weird, so we're starting on a Sunday, instead because that just makes more sense in my brain at least that's like the start of the week so i've been up for a while but i've been just chilling in my bed it is i feel like you do that on purpose every time but it's 2 10 i don't even know if y'all can see the time but it's 2 10 and i have somewhere to be like i need to leave the house by three o'clock because i'm going to Giant Eagle and Party City. I'm having a 18th birthday party because y'all know December is my birthday month. You know, best month out of the whole year. It's long awaited and it's loved every time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's my 18th birthday this year. So I'm having a party. I feel like the camera's so close to my face. Like, is it zoomed up? It was zoomed up. Okay. So yeah, 18 birthdays a big one, so I wanted to have a party. I mean, I wanted to have a party for my 16th, but it was COVID, and it was a lot of stuff going on at that time. But this time, we're less COVID and less stuff going on at the same time. So I'm having a birthday party. And I need to go pick out some stuff for that because it's in two weeks. My birthday's the 15th, but the party is on the 16th because it's a Friday. I sent out, like, the flyers today, like, I invited some people, and then, like, some people were like, oh, if you want to come, you can text me, and then, you know, I'll put you on the list or whatever, um, but I think it's going to end up being a small intimate party, I'm going to kind of, like, a rager, not a rager, but, like, I don't know, but we'll see what it turns out to be, I, it's still too early to tell, but I don't know, yeah, but I'm about to get in the shower before I leave, Cause I also have somewhere I'm hanging out with somebody today. I probably won't record that because like it's the first time that we're hanging out and I don't know. I just feel like that doesn't really give the vibes. I don't know. We'll see when we get there. I just need to get ready. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I gotta interject really quick. I don't know if you can hear Lauren this morning, but y'all know that TikTok trend where well, it's not really a trend, but the dial soap, the yellow dial soap, the tea tree, and like vitamin E something or something like. And I was like, I don't think that the dial soap that's like drying, like it's literally bar soap. Like I'm like, there's no way that I can do that because that's gonna work for my skin. And I've been trying to clean, clear up like the sides of my face for the longest, like. Literally, I don't, well, not even for months. It literally started breaking out like last year, probably. I'm here, it has been probably like a year now. Just randomly, and I just thought it was because of the mask and stuff, like the side of my face. I haven't been wearing a mask as much lately, and it still was there. And I was like, I literally can't figure it out. I'm telling you guys, I've probably been using the tea tree oil for like a week and a half now. My skin is literally clearing up. Like, it's not fully clear yet, but it's like so much different. And I get like hormonal breakouts, and literally, I didn't get like a bad breakout. Like, I literally, it was like pretty much nothing. It wasn't even on my cheeks. Like, it was like, they had like a pimple on my forehead or something. And basically, all I did was add the tea tree oil, which I had tried tea tree oil, but I was putting it on after that moisturizer. And I think that was just like too much for my skin. But like, after, I just put it in with my face wash and then like wash it off and then I would use my super clean oil afterwards as my regular moisturizer and it's literally made so much of a difference I literally just put one drop you guys should try it um you might not want to try the full thing like literally the tea tree oil and the vitamin E oil whatever they put in there you might want to try that because like it's literally great for my skin so I just want to say that sorry for cutting music but Black 
just never opened it. But I, it's not like I don't know what's in here. This is my sheen package. And I feel so accomplished. I finally hit box status. So yeah, I feel so accomplished. But yeah, I just got a bunch of stuff. I got, not really, I didn't actually get a bunch, I feel like. I got a lot of like business casual. I don't even want to come out the bag. Box, I mean. I got a bunch of business casual stuff because that's literally all I get to wear now because that's literally what I do every day. I don't even go to school every day, but I go to work every day, pretty much. And I was just sick of wearing the same stuff over and over, and I wanted to spice it up. So I got some stuff. Um, I won't do a proper haul now because I don't really have time for that. But one of my outfits is in here, so that's really why I opened the box um, to get one of my outfits. This is what I'm wearing today. This is a sweatsuit. And I thought this would be a better match. This is so much darker than I thought. But you'll still try to put it on. It's a beanie. And then I got this puffer vest. We'll see what that looks like. But yeah, I'm going to put it on. And we'll do the haul later, like I said. This puffer jacket looks... Ignore my bonnet. This puffer jacket looks extremely too small. Like, look at my... Like, no. Bye. This is so small. And I don't think it's going to match because the colors against each other are just like, they're not matching. I'm still going to try it on. First of all, to see if it fits, not even to wear it as a fit because I clearly can see. I mean, not that I can't do monochromatic and then literally not be matchy-matchy, but like still, this thing does not look like it's going to fit. Okay, I guess it does fit. It's supposed to be cropped, I guess, probably. It definitely doesn't go with the outfit, but like I thought it would. But it's not as bad as I thought. Like, it's like, mm, I feel like it wouldn't look good with like a sweatshirt like this. But like, it's not as bad as I thought. It's definitely cropped and small, though. Let me flip it over, because what if I flip it over and it's better? I can just wear the pink side and then have like a little bit of the... How is it reversible when there's tags on the side, like? Wear like this. No, I just don't like it with the sweatshirt. Like it just doesn't work. This is very really hot. It's thick material. It's good material, y'all. And I got a medium in this set because I wanted the top to be baggy still, but like I need to make sure the bottoms fit. The beanie, let's see the beanie. If it goes with the fit, I'm trying to be like one of the fashion it girls. Like still burning up. I think I can still pull it off. Like it's like. You can kind of tell that it's not matchy-matchy, but it doesn't look bad. I'm going to wear it. Yeah, I like it. My New Balances. My nude New Balances. Or, like, should I put bubble slides? But the bubble slides also, they're, like, really light. I mean, so are my new, sh my new new Balances. And then I'm going to wear some long socks. And I'm just going to put on a random perfume. I feel like low-key we can get vanilla today. Bro, I smell these perfumes in my mouth. Burberry her. I'm been, like you know I haven't gotten a chance to smell it and everybody's been saying stuff. So I'm like I gotta smell it since we're in Sephora. Burberry her and Perfect by Marc Jacobs. Those are gonna be my next purchases for sure. It's two fifty eight and I know I had to leave at three so we gotta go. I just gotta pick out figure out what she's gonna wear but I'm gonna just ask my mama. So yeah, and we're gonna leave. So see y'all later. from the bakery okay so I'm thinking about getting you like I said that's what I got I hope not. silver cross blessed <laughs> they must have got rid of anything they don't got nothing for no adults or nothing? Do you see something? I guess I'm getting a unicorn cake. <laughs> Shut up, though. Well, so how see. do you think you want it designed, though? Do you have something in mind? No, not really. I was hoping they were going to have something in there. Have something that you could look at. Okay. 
So that's the thing. We don't really. Okay. I was say I thought they would too. I thought they. Would. When do you need to buy it? Not until the sixteenth. Okay. Um, like, is it something like extravagant? Like, yeah, it's, it's for my eighteenth birthday. birthday party. Oh, okay. Well, happy yeah. birthday. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Um, and so we're. I'm, I'm gonna order cupcakes for the guests. Okay. But right. I did just want a nice something decorated for her yeah. self to mm-hmm. blow out, and then you know the of guests would get the cupcakes. Mm-hmm. So if you look can look up some designs, we'll have to come. If I'm the white white great white, that kind of looks does. good. It kind of does. Good. I think I'm gonna buy some. You're gonna buy that peach cup, canela. Yeah. I Maybe mean, I'm not. White peach and great wine. Why are you not trying to buy it? Huh? Why are you not trying to buy it? Because I ain't gonna drink it. That's it might be good. It might be, but I ain't gonna drink it. I'm drinking. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> No, you can be born. You don't have to be born in 1985. I mean, 1985 people are 40. Almost. You only got to be born in 2001. I should name 21. Like, what? It is now 8. Oh, I'm showing y'all all my Snapchat. Hold on. 8 11. Whatever. I just got back from Slim Chickens. I literally haven't talked to y'all since we we didn't end up getting Charlie's. We didn't end up going to party today. So pretty much we did absolutely nothing. <laughs> that whole trip was for my birthday stuff. And we didn't get a cake. We didn't get the balloons. But I'm about to eat this for dinner. They got like jerk chicken and salmon, but I don't really eat that kind of stuff. Like Mm, but I will eat a chicken sandwich. It's probably weird. Y'all probably think I'm crazy because my family thinks I'm crazy too. But it just makes more like I don't know for my appetite. It just makes more sense. Oh yeah, I just got a cayenne ranch sandwich meal, kind of fries oddly. And then for my drink, I got an Oreo shake. Some things are becoming like the best milkshake because they're so thick. And they're just so good. That's like even as fat straw, you still be struggling to suck it up. But yeah, I didn't want to like leave y'all hanging, but I expected to do more today. I didn't end up going out. I thought I was gonna go out. Loki, I don't know if it was considered a ghost or what, but yeah, pretty much I got ghosted or stood up, whatever. And yeah, so that's gonna wrap up today because I don't want to ramble anymore. And I'm probably gonna watch Wednesday while I do my while I finish this food. I'm looking getting full already and I haven't even touched my sandwich. But yeah, I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, it's the next day. I'm wearing the same outfit like I told y'all, so don't be surprised. But I actually really am wearing it because I literally wore it for like less than an hour. It is December fifth, by the way, it's Monday. Um, I have to go to school. It is 10.33. I have to be leave by 10.40 to go to my college class. I'm trying to debate if I should bring y'all to school with me. I'm not going to probably film in there because like, it's just like not filming. I don't know. It, I don't know. I wouldn't, at least definitely wouldn't film in my first class. But I don't know. And I'm just picking on my outfit for track. I know. I think I'm gonna just wear this tie-dye t-shirt with these blue biker shorts. Yeah, but pretty much, yeah, I'm about to leave. This morning, I just did, like, homework. I didn't want to show you all that because, one, I was in, like, uncomfortable position where it was, like, mm, I don't even know where I would set the camera up. And, like, I was just laying in my bed doing it. So, yeah, I was like, mm, maybe not.
I'm gonna start my day for real, for real. I haven't ate anything today, but I brought my slim chickens that I had last night that I didn't finish. I'm just gonna eat that for lunch and probably get something to drink. But yeah, let me get out of here before I be late for real, for real. I just finished my first class for the day. It's 12:15. Technically, I didn't have to stay for the whole. Well, I guess I really didn't stay for the whole thing, but I ended up staying longer than I thought I was because I was trying to. We were doing like uh, preparing for our next essay, and it's the final. Um, right now, usually this is when I would get lunch, but I have to pick up my f best friend from her house so she can come to school because we have the, our next class together, and right now she can't drive her car, so I have to pick her up, which is what I'm doing right now. Um, if this garbage truck is in the way, it's taking all day. DoorDash? What? You can actually put your seatbelt on today. Your friend is here. Yeah. Now she's trying to vlog up in here. Are you recording right now? Yeah. Hey y'all! I got my Chipotle bowl. We got chicken, lettuce. lettuce it's corn. the saying it out out of order. Chicken, lettuce. Okay, wait. I got white and brown rice. Chicken, sour cream, cheese, lettuce, and corn. about today or the vlogging. Bro, I did not. Can you even see me? It probably can. I got my lemon water, y'all. It's nasty. It's literally gonna taste like literally like water now. I mean that's Amazing. We're recording. Am I recording it right? Yeah. Oh. It's same recording at the time. Okay, but why is it counting like that? Okay, the fit. We got the vapor maxes. Ripped jeans. I don't know how to. What are you doing? Period. You're, what are you doing? I don't know. What does that mean? Flipping and stuff. Oh, wait. You <laughs> got to go to this side so the light can hit you. Period. Mm. It's giving. She looks so happy. Uh, extra like me. I'm about to get extra speed, and it's probably still not going to be speed. Uh, Hi. Hi. Don't worry. Good. How are you? Fantastic. She don't never hold no door for herself, y'all. I was. I was trying to look at the camera. It's a shame. I really can't. Extra sweet tea, and it better be extra, cause. Okay, y'all. I just. We got to practice. It doesn't start. It's like 3 o'clock right now. 3.05. It doesn't start until 3.30. But I need to like change my clothes obviously. And stuff. So that's what I'm about to do now. I realized I forgot a water bottle. I, I literally cannot remember everything. Like I have too many things too. That I have to remember that in the morning. It's like I'm bound to forget something. I'm about to go change them in the bathroom in here because it, there's never anybody in the bathroom and obviously it's just private because it's a stall and stuff but yeah i'm about to go change in the bathroom and start practice i don't know if i'll talk to y'all during practice probably not see y'all later y'all we just got out of practice y'all gotta talk to my vlog um, um so basically it was so <laughs> on a scale from zero being <laughs> not hot i mean hard <laughs> and then the highest is not hard i'll say it's an eight or not okay Guys, we had to do um two um two laps four times, and it was pretty good. But I would give the whole workout a seven out of ten because it wasn't bad. Exactly. Am I? Um, I didn't like the workout because I'm not in shape. So, uh, the, the hardest is the hardest. The, no, the easiest. Low, yeah, the easiest. The lowest is the hardest. Yeah. Uh, zero. Oh. I mean, okay, am I a what? Okay, like a five. Five. 
I give it like uh, seven and a half. I mean, yeah. seven. Yeah, seven and a half, seven. Because like I'm not a 400 runner, but they, it wasn't that. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. But this is my posse, my little school bus, because yeah, I'm a school yeah. bus driver. Yeah, Gotta make sure everybody get home, you know. Hey vlog. It's been a minute. It's 8:48. Um, really, I've been home just doing a bunch of random stuff. But this is what we have for dinner: tacos. It's Monday, but you know, Taco Monday works too. It's cold now, but I have been eight, so. And I'm about to finish this drink. It's a frosted lemonade that I homemade at the ice cream shop. And I'm about to have some popcorn for my dessert. It's gonna be my dessert for the day. I feel like I just have to have dessert. Like, I don't know. It's getting me. It didn't used to always be like that, but now I just feel like I have to have it. So yeah, this is gonna be my dessert, my healthy alternative. But tomorrow, it's gonna be crazy because I have to go to work to 10 to three. Then I got presents at 3.30. And then I have my NHS induction ceremony for like the younger kids. I'm already in NHS, so we have to go at six. Like, you're crazy. Like, all of this, back to back to back to back. I'm not gonna get no break. I don't know when I'm gonna do my homework. I'm gonna just cap the video right here because who knows if I'll come back. Probably won't. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hello, welcome to Duck. Can I get things today? Hi, can I please have a medium ice caramel coffee? Can it be decaf, please? And Any then. Cream sugar in that? Yeah, can I have three creams and four sugars, please? I like your nose, by the way. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Y'all, my coffee is wrong. I can tell by the color. I'm about to cry. I'm so sick of this. It's so dark. Why is it so dark? Let me look at the label. I feel like they be lying. Like, they don't be paying attention, I feel like, to the label. Bruh. What the freak is this? This is a joke. They just be slapping labels on coffees, I swear. I just be having no guts to tell the people that they didn't make it right. Like, I don't know if I should bring my camera in there, but I could just put it in my bag so they won't know. And then it'll be okay. Then they won't know. So you guys are coming in my bag. Good morning. Where have you been? Where have you been is the real question. You ready for calling in, Elijah? I'm not going to be here today. Oh, okay. So, are you guys ready? Yeah, so you can call until you leave? Mm-hmm. I need to be late to practice because I'm gonna be late because I'm just now leaving five minutes late and I already know there's gonna be extra traffic because there was traffic last time I left late <sighs> and I still haven't eat I just ate those fries that's all I ate y'all i would never ate the sandwich so I'm like should I eat it on the way there is that doing too much and then that's gonna make my stomach hurt. I don't think today's gonna be a super hard day, which is why I'm like literally debating it. Tuesdays are drill days, but like still, that could still make my stomach hurt. I don't know what to do, y'all. I literally had to run out there because they asked me to do something at the last second, but like they didn't realize that I had to leave and neither did I. And luckily they <laughs> the person didn't pick up. But it was a good day at work. Like I'm only messing with it. Like it was great. Half of this vlog being in the car, sorry y'all. This is where I'm at for most of my times. So I only have free time when I'm not, in, when I'm in the car. Um, it is 5.39 and I am at my school for this NHS ceremony. There's too many cars here, like it hasn't even, I don't wanna show y'all, but like the parking lot is full. Like y'all thirsty, it doesn't even start until six o'clock. 
And it's only 5 39. So, y'all look, he doing too much. Because what did you hear this early for? Like, you're doing way too much, baby. But I just have the same outfit I had on earlier. I just hurried up and I'm going to finish my literally bite of a sandwich. Yeah, I'll probably go in there like 10 minutes before 6. But I'll talk to y'all later. Hey, okay, y'all, I am back from the thing. It literally took an hour and a half. Unnecessary. But I got two packages. I kind of opened both of them, but I already knew what both of them were. One of them is my tassel. Because, you know, we big rad. Big rad 2023. You know what I'm saying? It's giving bling bling. Big rad. You know the vibes. And then this is Dakota's Christmas present. But I won't show y'all because she probably watches my videos. And I don't want her to know what she got for Christmas. But it's a sentimental gift. I got some mail from a college that I got accepted into. And it says financial aid. Let's see if I got a scally wally. Congratulations on your admissions to blank university. Fall 2023. Please to inform me that you've been selected to receive the excellence awards program funding bye this is not even nothing 6500 annually like boy i mean my, a dollar is a dollar but you know what i'm so saying much on a way for i'm just saying like a dollar is a dollar but oh, yeah. they could have gave me more money well you know what i got period and i also got an additional two thousand dollars annually for filling out my fafsa and having a 3.0 above a 3.0 I'm ready for the presidential scholarship. <laughs> Let me get that. That's ready. That's what I want. But this is good. First offer. I'm not probably going to go to this school anyway, but appreciate the money game. You know what I'm saying? Somebody need to double it. You know, I had to double it. Good morning, guys. It is 10 o'clock on the dot period. It's Wednesday the 7th. I just got finished taking my test. I'm technically finished with all, like my math class into my final I have to do my comm and my my communication class and my writing class still which is what i have to go to today but today is the last day of like physical class and then we'll have our i won't even have a final for either one of those classes actually because there's no final but i have to write a paper and then for my online classes i have two I have finals for those so that's two finals i have to take next week but yeah I'm about to get ready to get dressed. I have to leave the house by 10.40 at the latest. Well, really like 10.45 at the latest. Um, but I'm about to get ready. I just have the same turtleneck on right now that I had on yesterday. So I didn't look crazy on the camera. Um, and then my pajama pants, of course. And yeah, I'm about to get ready and make my bed a little bit. And I'll show you my outfit and stuff. You know, I gotta do come crazy for the last day, you know what I'm saying? And plus, I have my internship later on today, too. So, I'm gonna put on a cute outfit, and we're gonna see. I'm gonna put on something that I never wore. Okay, y'all, so this is my outfit that I'm going to wear. But I, shirt from Sheen, and so was the, so are the pants. Um, I just got these pants, and I wanted to style them. But I don't know if I should do these shoes, or just the classic beat-up bands. But I'm... Leaning more towards the Vans be just because I feel like the patterns don't like it's just too many patterns. So I'm gonna try it on and then I'm gonna show y'all. All right, y'all. So what do y'all think? Should I like tuck it in on one side that like asymmetrical, or should I like flip it? Right, right. But yeah, these pins are cute. I thought it would be less bad, big at the bottom, low key, but it's okay. I think maybe this is the vibe, and then I just tie the knot. I, like I said, I'm leaning towards the vans just because the pattern, like pattern on pattern. But and I feel like this because this has like a white base. So we are gonna go with the vans. Hey guys, I was talking to y'all, but I'm pretty sure my SD card is full, so I need to fix that. I don't even know if I have the thing to like put the SD card in my computer. So we might not be able to fix it today, which is kind of sad because I don't want to vlog on my phone. But I'm about to go pick up Dakota. I don't really even know if y'all even heard anything I just said, but I just got out of class. 
Um, we just had to write our first draft. And pretty much, I have most of it done. Not all of it. We only have like an hour. It's, the class is only an hour. And I feel like I need more than an hour to finish. Maybe like an hour and a half. It would have been cool and I would have been finished. But but yeah, I'm just on my way to pick her up. I don't know if I vlog because the fact that I have to be on my phone is so annoying. But yeah, I'm almost there to pick up Dakota. So I'll talk to y'all later. But I am at my internship. Um, I'm a little early. So I'm kind of just... Finishing up my canes. We ended up getting canes for lunch. Low-key, I'm just waiting in the car because I'm early and I don't want to go in there early. I'm not probably like that it makes no sense. But it's like, she's not going to be ready for me if I'm early. And we still got to wait for the other person to get here. So, if I'm early, even when I'm on time, he still comes after me. So I think today we're supposed to have a writer's room. Hopefully we do. I don't know if I'm going to record because, like, they don't know I do YouTube, and I feel like that's kind of weird. If yeah, the conversation comes up, maybe, but it's also, like, I already told y'all I don't like people that I know knowing that they watch my videos. It's just a little cringe. But I'm probably late now. Well, I'm not late. I'm on time now, so I'm going to leave so I'm not late, even though she really doesn't care if I'm late or not. But, yeah. I'm about to leave and go in there now, so. Peace on the streets, y'all. I just, I'm just done leaving. Internship, we just did like a writer's room ish. We didn't really read much, we just had like a kind of a discussion about the play and like expectations and things that were she changed. And basically, I'm just gonna look at it tonight and then we're gonna talk about it tomorrow because I also have to go to tomorrow morning. I'm going home, I don't want to drive with my phone on the highway, so I will talk to you guys later. I feel like this vlog has been so boring for today. I'm very, very sorry. That's that. See you guys later. And sees it is now today, it is 10 01 on uh, December 8th. I am at my internship. It's 10.01, like you said, I'm supposed to be there at 10. Um, she probably will be a little bit late. I, mean, I haven't eaten yet, which is, like, the worst decision I could ever made. But I was running a little bit, not behind, but, like, if I would have got something to eat, I would have been behind. So I didn't get anything to eat. But, yeah, I'm about to go in there. I'm in here. It is 10.04, 10.05-ish. And I'm starving. She's still here. I should show y'all the fit of the day. Because I didn't this morning. Technically, I don't have to dress business casual, but I do most days. I most days I do because I have to go to work after anyway. HBCU, Shaw University, in Raleigh. Yeah, it is the oldest HBCU to begin offering courses in the South. Period. Shaw. It's a private HBCU. Oh. And I just did like the Comic Black app, but I didn't apply, like put this on my favorites list. But you know, the Comic Black app, everybody gets to see your stuff. They tell me my admission decision is open, but I'm opening the app. Hi, first of all, prediction, I probably got in. Okay, love you, update. Oh, congratulations. On behalf of the Shaw University family, I am pleased to inform you that I've been admitted to Shaw University for fall 2023. I literally never, like, directly applied. But period, another college on the list, I guess. Okay, yeah, but I'm not really surprised. I kind of once i saw the requirements to get in it was like a 2.0 gpa i knew i was gonna get in <laughs> not trying to be funny but yeah i left my internship like 30 minutes ago and i'm at five guys low-key i'm pissed off because why somehow i got freaking like oil on my shoe and it just ruined my shoe and I can't clean it off because it's oil so it needs like soap. So I'm pretty sure now nah, this shoe is ruined and I'm so irritated. But I got a burger and fries. Um, I got mayo, lettuce, pickle, tomato, mushroom, and bacon. I got a regular one but I think that might be too much food. I didn't realize that it was too 
I don't know what I thought, but I usually get a little, but I was like, I get a big today. First of all, that junk was freaking ten dollars for the sandwich. I'm kind of irritated about that. And the fries are freaking five dollars. I'm about to go home or to the practice spot, depending on what time I think I'm gonna get there. I was gonna go to work and just go to the later practice today, but I didn't write that essay, so I don't want to be there too late. No point. But yeah, so I'll talk to y'all later. Hey, best booze. It is later. It's a lot later, actually. I gotta do these dishes because my mama told me how to do the dishes. What bar I'm gonna be? So that's what I'm doing, but really, there's nothing recording worthy. My life is genu genuinely boring on an everyday to day basis. But tomorrow, I have to find some decorations, I think. My mom says she's thinking about it, going to see them. It's really like balloons and stuff. We'll see if that even happens for real. Because she was saying, oh, I can just get this lady to do it for us. The lady that does the event center. So, I don't know. We'll see. But we're supposed to do that at 10 a.m. But let me get these dishes done so she don't say nothing. Mommy, I did the dishes. Yeah. And I'm going to go to bed. So, I'll just see you guys tomorrow. I want something sweet. Low-key, I might come back because I'm thinking about roasting marshmallows. I need, like, a dessert. Good morning, y'all. It is... I don't even know what my phone is right now. This is the outfit for today. I'm thinking I should... I need a belt. Because the pants are low-key too big, I probably should have gotten medium. All of these pieces are from Sheen, by the way, if you wanted to know. I need to desperately iron my pants. So, we're about to iron my pants. I was going to crease them, y'all, but I don't know how to do that. And if I mess them up, it's fatal. It's the end of it. So I'm not re-ironing really them. So, to get the crease out. Oh, also, she told me to tie up the shirt instead of tucking it halfway in. I feel like I look like a cute little business girl. Period. I was going to go to work at 10. It's 10 o'clock right now. It's actually good at the 10 o'clock. Um, but, like I remember, I was telling you I wanted to go pick up balloons with my mom today. Because the ones we were originally going to get, they're literally sold out. Like, what? She doesn't get off work until 10.30, so I have to wait, so I won't be going to work until 12, maybe. Oh, awesome. I tried on my birthday dress this morning. I opened the package with you guys yesterday night, but that was when I thought I was recording, and I wasn't, so you guys didn't even get to see me open the package. I'm not going to show you guys my, it on my body. I feel like that's too much of a spoiler, but this is what it looks like. Imagine it's a, like a cow neck. Is that what you call it? Or like whatever. Kind of slip dress, whatever. Kind of vibe. But it's like sparkly. It's a little like thin material. I did get it from Amazon, so I should have been expecting that low key. So I need to find like something to put under it so you can't see. I'm about to clean my room though, and I'll see you guys when we're like on the way or there or whatever. So, guys, yeah, so we just got back from the balloon place. Bruh, I'm not. We're probably not buying balloons from there. We're probably gonna get somebody, the person that owns the complex that um, my event is gonna be at, to do the decorations because first of all, they're so expensive, like $50. That lady was saying $50 for one balloon. Like, girl, are you crazy? My mom was like, yeah, that stuff is expensive. She said they, that place has always been like overpriced and stuff, but still, like $50 is crazy. But I just got Taco Bell. My mom got me some for lunch. Oh, oh the alpacas are out. Can y'all see them? Y'all can't see them, I don't think. They're so cute. They got all of them out right now. Like, literally every single one. Usually, it's only like three or four out at a time. There's like at least seven of them. But I'm on my way to work. It is 1230. Um... I should get there by like one o'clock but my mom is encouraging me to do this prank on my dad y'all know the diesel prank where you like tell your dad that you put diesel in your car and it's like not working or whatever i just have to figure out how i'm gonna record and be like oh i need you to help me put air in my tires and by the way i think something's wrong in my car yeah that's what i'm gonna do i feel like he doesn't yell at work or anything but i feel like he'll be actually be so upset like i don't think he's gonna be calm like because literally that literally means my car's broken. Like, but yeah, I'll see y'all.
next clip is probably gonna be the prank. I'll see y'all later. So we just did the prank, but I put the recording in charge of one of my coworkers and she failed to record the prank. But yeah, she didn't record it. He still doesn't know that it's a prank, but he was very calm, so it wasn't even really that good. He was like, just call the auto body shop. I'm pretty sure you just messed up your car. You're gonna you're gonna have to get a new car. So I didn't even get a video. Cause I told her to record and then she stopped recording because she got scared. She messing up my career, like my content. I finished my work. I told my dad it was a prank, but I like to say it was calm anyway. It's five something. Look at the Christmas tree they have in here. So cutesy, right? The little fake gifts. Happy holidays. We got like candy canes and stuff. I'm waiting for my dad because we're supposed to fill my tires literally right after I got to work, but he's chip chattering with one of the employees about cars. Uh, but I'm at Subway. I just got back from Johnny Go. And I also decided to, since I had to waste time to wait for the speaking on Subway, I'm like, I'll go to the I don't know why I just convinced myself that was a good idea, but I got a cup fiction, mountain cup fiction with caramel instead of fudge. It should be done soon, but I doubt it's going to be ready on time, which is annoying. I don't want to be that person that literally walks in as soon as it's supposed to be ready, but I don't want to be here any longer. I'll give them like three more minutes. Thank you. I'm sorry, you have a big family. <laughs> like my parents, not me. Sorry. Have a good night. Thank you. Yeah. <gasps> That's so good. Congratulations. <laughs> That's so cute. That was a girl that she we go to school together. We like friends ish, I would say. We haven't talked in a while though, but we got like really close pretty close last year because of one of the classes that we were in it was like really small all girls class and it just felt like because of that i just felt like really intimate and everybody in that class felt super but yeah i'm about to head home and bring this food home and call it i see what i'll do for the rest of the night i'm not really sure hey y'all it is currently 10 12 so right now, I was just like making a backup playlist for my party. I do have a DJ, but I just wanted to make sure that, you know, if not, it's covered. I will give him a list, like a small, short list of songs that are must-haves in my party that we will not be having finishing the party without the songs being played. Almost four hours, three hours and 51 minutes right now. The party is four hours long, but I feel like I should go a little bit past, like four hours and 30 minutes just to be safe. But yeah, that's going to be a good night. I'll see you guys in the morning. So I just pulled up, right? Why is my boss here? You're not supposed to be here. You told me to come in. So why are you here? Okay. Okay. So pretty much my boss was chill with me coming in. I don't think they really realize. But I was just talking with my, my girl and my coworker. She's cool. Um, but yeah, she just left because she left a little early because it's just six flat now, um, six o'clock on the dot now. But they put me in charge of this like project. They want me to create a sign for these. We're selling these for the first time, and they want to create a sign for it. And it's like, girl, we don't even have a printer, so I have to literally draw it out. Like, are you crazy? Are you crazy? But we're we're getting our coffee stuff. I guess they do the first test run today that's pretty they said i hate this place because it literally makes the most weirdest sounds and it's like scary but yeah we got our we have been have been we have already had our i can't even speak we've already had our coffee makers like the espresso makers and stuff for special shots for like the longest time but we need like other stuff i guess like syrups and like flavoring and i don't really know how this stuff works but I'm just working on this, and yeah, y'all just, I guess y'all can just watch me do this. Okay, so this is what I have. Cute-ish. The end looks a little terrible, but that's because the ink bled. 
but it's okay it's okay but like i'm thinking maybe i should line the black and like blue but like what if you can't see it i don't know we'll try it and see and i'll come back okay y'all so this is the finish with the blue outline it looks okay but that's really user okay my camera died on me of course because that's literally all it seems to do hmm what do you think? You can literally tell that it's a uh, printed paper. I had to like tape two pieces of paper together to make it. But I have to put it on one of these display tables that we have. I'm gonna do it on this one though. For sure. Okay, y'all can only see it from the back, so I feel like y'all can't really see how dumb it looks. But, I don't know. What do you guys think? And I hate my sign now. It doesn't fit. It needs color. The sign the sign isn't it. But, like, what do I do for the sign? I need a printer. I need a printer. Because it needs, it needs color. That's really the problem. It's not me. It's not me. It's the, it's the resources that I lack. Period. Uh, I'll be back. I'll figure out what I'm going to do. All right, so this is the final product. This is the best I could do. I am not an artist. I cannot draw to save my life, first of all. Second of all, we need more resources. We have no coloring tools. We have no printer. I'm a digital girl, but this is the best that I came up with. I just cut off one of the things off our old thing and just put taped it at the bottom. And I feel like it looks a little bit better, but I still hate it. But I don't know. That's not my business. We'll see what she says. I think she'll probably agree. Somebody's coming, so I'll see y'all later.